Hey y'all, it's the Costume Jeweler. It's been a while since we've been in this Sunshine Thrift Store in St. Petersburg, Florida. We're going to go in here and look for purses and jewelry for resale on YouTube and eBay. Hit that notification bell, hit that thumbs up for this video. Check out my purses on eBay at ebay.com forward slash USR forward slash Costume Jeweler. And subscribe to my channel. Let's go see what we can find. So no jewelry bags in here today, guys, but look what you've got. You've got a pair of Gucci shoes. Gucci goose, Gucci shoes. And size 18 Nikes. I can't imagine. So usually there's jewelry bags in here, but right now there's not. And so a large store. The jewelry and purses are right over there. And then there are more purses on the wall. And we always start with the purses on the wall. Then we go look at the jewelry and the purses behind the counter. Look at all these. Not sure what purse this is. Looks like a bowling ball purse. Has the initials of HK, but no mark on the inside. Liz Claiborne. Look at this one. So I've had a purse similar to this before. Where it's like the woven leather the one I had though things could fall through it see if this is branded it's not branded <clears throat> it's a still a cool purse though love the color it's not camouflage of course but it reminds me of like a camouflage purse but it's not but the browns and the grays and the gold together urban expressions <clears throat> this store keeps a pretty good eye on the purses as far as when they are sorting them because they put ones on the wall that aren't always the best but still you could find that diamond in the rough you could it's a possibility anything is possible I found lots of purses yesterday at what I call the purse superstore. Always find a lot of purses at the purse superstore. Let's see if there's any wallets. I haven't been in here in probably four weeks. Because I've been in Texas. Here's Relic. Wish that were a fossil. I know that a fossil owns Relic, I believe, but I like my fossils. Kenneth Cole. There's a Goodwill next door too that we're going to go into. I don't usually film in that Goodwill because I never find any purses in there. This looks like a Rubik's Cube purse. That's interesting. So it looks like a Rubik's Cube was used. This is by a company called Rebags out of the Philippines. It's different. lock wallet it's 
see how today we're going to go to two thrift stores. I at least hit, <clears throat> when I go thrifting, I do at least one store, if not two or three or four. Just depends. Found a great croc by Anya a few days ago. A croc print. I've never had a croc print by Anya. Here's another one. I've bought these in the past. I don't buy them as much anymore, but I have done it in the past. Coldwater Creek. We'll go look at the whatnots today, too. After the purses and jewelry, see what they've got. Okay, we're gonna go up behind the jewelry counter and see if we get it having luck there we didn't have any luck with all of these purses so we'll go check those out so go over here and see if we can find any jewelry and name brand purses so here are the purses behind the counter you can't usually tell what wallets are there you have to get the clerks to pull them down as far as purses I don't always pull every purse out I'll usually ask for some of the name brands to see what they have There's one right here that I wonder if it's a fossil. I don't know if it is or not, it's right there. Let's see. Let's probably check that one out. They usually have a bigger selection than that. So this is not fossil, but it's in great condition. It's Cuba. <laughs> Look how pretty that is. You have all these pockets. That's nice. It looks like new. Looks like new on the inside too. If somebody used this, they didn't hardly use it. Wow, that's a very nice bag. Hmm, not to think on that one. I'm gonna see a wine. A wine colored bag right there. We're gonna check that out. So a B. Mikowski crossbody bag. This is a great bag. We're going to get this one. That was a hard purse to get. So we're going to get that one. And then these earrings right here are great too. So we're going to zoom in. So we're going to look at some more jewelry, guys. I'm not sure what this pendant is right here. Look at this red one. Looking to see if there's anything we can't live without. That big shell pendant necklace is nice. This is their little clearance section. I do love these earrings a lot. So hopefully we find some good stuff in here, but you never know. It's a 
take a look at the earrings. Oh, look at these. I like these. Those are cute. So we're going to get those. Are these pieces of leather? These are huge. These are clip-ons and they're marked on the back. I'm going to see if I can tell what they say. Kenneth J. Lane, guys. Look at this. Wow. Clip-on earrings. Huge. You could convert them to a uh, pierced, but that's Kenneth J. Lane. Those are probably about three inches diameter. At least two and a half inches diameter. We're going to get those two. Big fat Kenneth J. Lane earrings. Looks like a cat bracelet, kitty cat bracelet. I love this necklace, guys. Look at this one. I love that. Okay. That's a really unique. So these are mine if you want to start a basket. Do you have a basket? Yeah, I have a basket. Okay. I guess I'll take a look at this bracelet right here too, please. Which one? This one? This one right here. So this guy's right here is $175. This is actually a wine sipping cup. And I do have a couple of these, not with that um, coin in the middle, but I do have this same thing. And they run pretty expensive. I don't know how much this one will be, but it's already high at $175. What is that little thing? So we're looking at the Watnati stuff, but I don't really see anything. These are not old. So they usually also have purses, not purses, but bags in the back. We'll go take a look at some of those. Coffee mugs. So look at this tray, guys. That's awesome. It's not old, but it's different. So we did find a few pieces of jewelry, guys. We did not find any purses. But that's okay. You can't do that every time. Look at these little clowns. So, we are going to go check out. So, please hit the thumbs up on this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on new live bite nows and jewelry auctions. 
And until next time, we will see you guys later.